What is good, ladies and gentlemen, on YouTube? It's your boy Foxy. Welcome back to the Fox's Den. Getting into another reaction. We are getting into the newest episode of One Piece 1101. God damn. That's crazy. We got a whole new fucking page on the fucking website for the episodes. I mean, god damn, we are just fucking up there in the numbers now, baby. Again, I don't know what order I'm uploading these reactions. We just got done watching Kaiju number eight. We watched Ninja Kamui a little bit earlier. So I'll just go ahead and go through this spiel real quick. Get into these reactions late because I was sick this past week. You can probably hear my voice still a little bit. I'm feeling a lot better, but I've started this sore throat. It's kind of annoying while I'm doing these reactions too because I gotta talk continuously, which I haven't been doing at all this week. So, yeah, uh, there's probably going to be a good amount of pauses or me coughing here and there a good amount because, yeah, my throat's just like, bro, you got to shut the fuck up. Like, I, I was used to you being fucking quiet and now you're trying to talk, so I'm going to make you suffer for it. All right, bud? So, yeah, that's where we're at with that. And then, yeah, also holding the mic because I uh, ended up breaking my mic arm. So, you know, unfortunate, but it lasted me a long time. I had it for like 10 years for, you know, my first mic arm awesome you know what i'm saying we're the investment and it's only like you know anywhere from 50 to 100 bucks for another one so i'll probably order that sometime this weekend and um yeah that's where we're at with those things and what's been going on the past week for now let's get into one piece baby oh my god i was so annoyed last week because i was recording and you know i saved one piece for last obviously because you know last episode was so hype episode a thousand or 1100 i mean it was a big fight between rob lucci and um Luffy in Gear 5 and just the nostalgia of those two characters going at it once again. Um, you know, a, a lot of variables within that episode and just the animation. I mean, stunning, absolutely stunning fucking episode. So yeah, I was really excited to get into, uh, you know, this episode, which I was thinking was going to be last week. But no, they did some little stupid recap bullshit or whatever the fuck. I can't, I don't know what the fuck it was, but it was not a new episode. And so I was like, okay, this is, this is ass, whatever. Um, so we didn't get an episode last week, but it's all good. That's where, uh, we're getting into now, uh, 11.01. And I'm assuming we're going to be continuing down this fight between Rob Lucci and Luffy. And Luffy just looks like he's having a fucking good time, bro. I mean, sure, Rob Lucci's going stronger, but I don't think you are, like, your strength, like, you, you've got stronger to where you can handle more, for sure. But Luffy has also gotten stronger since the last time he whooped yo ass and he's an emperor now and he has one of the craziest fruits no if not the craziest fruit devil fruit known to man i mean he's a literal god like hello so definitely cool that you've gotten stronger rob lucci but i don't think you're on the level of luffy bro and there's just no, there's just no way and you can kind of see it in how the fight's been playing out so far like yeah rob lucci's getting some shots in and He's doing his thing. He's going to be conniving. He's going to, you know, we saw at the end of the last episode, he took out fucking uh, Sentamaru. And, uh, you know, that's not good, you know, obviously. But, like, that's what Luffy and Sentamaru get for letting their guard down and just kind of, like, having a candid conversation on a fucking battlefield. So, but, hey, shit happens. But, uh, as I was saying, yeah, Luffy, I mean, bro, he just looks like he's just having a good time. He's just enjoying his Gear 5 self, you know what I'm saying? Just laughing it up, fucking Warrior of Liberation, just enjoying himself. Where he's not really sweating too much or like putting in all that much work to take out or, you know, take on Rob Lucci. I don't think he's going to have to do too much more else. I think he can keep up this pace just fine if he wanted to for forever against Rob Lucci. But we'll see if they wrap it up this episode or if it continues on some more and then we catch up with some other people or whatever the fuck else. I can't really remember uh, the ins and outs and details of where this, you know, ends and then like what plays out like around that uh, again you know it's been it's been a while since this this happened in the manga so but once we start like getting into it get to a position where like the fight the fight's stopping or we're moving on to something else i'll probably start to remember but uh yeah that's what we're getting into uh i'm very excited for this it's been a good two weeks without one piece and also about a month since fucking uh the manga went on break and that finally got a chapter last week and there should be a new chapter tomorrow as well um, and I'm fucking loving it, you know, can't get enough One Piece. So, let's get in the reaction, let's get in the episode. If you guys enjoy it, please like down below, comment, subscribe if you're new, and hit that notification bell so the next one's dropping. Let's get into it, One Piece, 
Mm, yeah, that's right. Yeah, he got the Seraphim under their control because he took out Cinemaru since Cinemaru was above them in hierarchy. In, in terms of like who they answer to. Damn, so he did try to defend himself. He just. Rob Lucci just got through. Man, shut your ass up, bro. Here we go. The Looney Tunes shit. Look, he's still smiling receiving that hit. God damn, they're going in on the soundtrack guitar solo and everything. Okay, so yeah, they're still under Sentamaro's control. But that's that's going to be their main goal now. Their, their main goal is going to be to take out Sentamaro. He's focusing him. Oh my god. Jesus. Whip the fuck out of him. Yeah, that's a whip, all right. What is this man's doing? <laughs> ah, damn, there's straight chaos on fucking Egghead now. Ever since these motherfuckers from CP0 showed up. Oh, nah, you're fucking with the strongest swordsman. Strongest swordsman's copy, bro. I don't think y'all want the smoke. Yeah, they're supposed to grow up too. Like, dude, that's crazy. Oh, that's right. Oh my goodness, bro. Completely forgot about who that belonged to. <laughs> Only the zone type. <laughs> So fucking terrible. Oh wow. Oh yeah, so yeah, du duplicated bow is fruit too. Look at that, turn to stone. That is fucking crazy, bro. Like, Vegapunk is way too smart. The strongest form of humanity. I mean, there's the episode title. <coughs> I mean, that definitely seems to be true. I mean, combined with Lunarian- He hasn't even mentioned the Lunarian shit yet. But duplicated devil fruits too, like, bro. And their copies of the former Sishibukai, like, dog.
Yo, Sentamaru is leaking, bro. But what the fuck do you know about anything, bro? You're just following orders from big ass motherfuckers on top of the world. Damn animation! Dude, what the fuck? He's trying to eat him? Oh, he's in his giant form. What are you doing? Oh my god. He's using the rubble in his mouth like a fucking gun. <laughs> what did he just think of, bro? That's what I'm talking about. This man is just like testing out new shit throughout this fight. But he's not taking this fight seriously. Ha ha ha! watch the fuck out. That shit gonna hurt, Luchi. Yo, that's fire! Oh my god, now that's a fucking punch. Jesus. Damn right, motherfucker, you don't stand a chance. <laughs> man's just having fun with you. <laughs> You're a kind of. <laughs> <laughs> believe... Seem to somewhat have their own personalities, kind of similar to the, the their originals. Bro, his fucking ear, that's hilarious. That's crazy. Once enemies, he's like, alright, fuck it, I'm gonna trust you. Oh, he launching himself quick. <laughs> Where is he? Oh shit. <laughs> 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 Bro, you just need to get some grub in, you know, take a nap, you'd be all right, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so fucking CP0 and Rob Lucci, they not getting the fuck up there, bro. Like, we we are good up here, dog. But such a down here by himself, like, fuck, bro. Oh, he went back to his normal form. What you looking at, bitch? 
Them he better just pass out from the blood loss. Damn, bruh. Yeah, how y'all gonna get up there? Huh? Damn, that episode flew the fuck by, bro. That was fucking gas, though, as usual. Alrighty, guys. What another amazing episode of One Piece. That was a good fucking watch. Good to be fucking back after last week's break that I did not know was happening. Um, or at least didn't know that there was going to be a recap of some, you know, fucking waste of my time. But, uh, yeah, finally back to the good shit. Saw Luffy still going at it with fucking Rob Lucci, still just kind of enjoying himself. Like, he's not taking the fight super fucking seriously, but, like, Rob Lucci was already understanding, like, towards the end of that, like, how fucking strong is he? Like, I feel like I'm about to pass out. Like, he was feeling himself on the verge of passing out and kind of realizing just how strong Luffy is now. And just, like, for a second there, like, actually taking a second to think about it, like, damn. I might not stand a fucking chance, even though I got stronger myself, too. You know what I'm saying? Which is fucking crazy to think about. That, like, Luffy's barely even trying and just, like, toying with him. And he promised to send tomorrow once again. Uh, or officially promised, like, yo, we're gonna get him off this island no matter what. Like, you know, he, he gave sent tomorrow his word that they were gonna get Vegapunk off this island. So, that's that's the goal, bruh. That's the goal is to get fucking Vegapunk off this island, you know, safe. We're gonna see how truly hard of a task that fucking is, though. You know what I'm saying? As this goes on. Um, but they officially, Luffy, Jinbei, Chopper, Bonnie, uh, and Atlas, they've all gotten up to the Labo phase. And so CP0 and Setamaru are the only ones that are really left down on the, like, you know, surface of Egghead now. And they can't just fucking do whatever they want and infiltrate up there, even if they wanted to. Like, it's too fortified. So, I guess we'll see what happens next episode and see what, you know, CP0's next plan of action is. Maybe they just wait for more orders. I can't really remember exactly the next step from here, but uh, I know we're in store for some good fucking shit, bro. Like, yeah, now we're, ah, oh, bro. I can't wait for what's to come, man. This shit is so fucking good. But that's another fucking great episode in the books. Can't complain. That's gonna do it for me. If you guys enjoyed the reaction, please like down below, comment, subscribe for new, hit the notification bell so the next one's dropping. I'll see y'all in the next one. Y'all be good. Deuces.